Well, we've been coming to New York during CMJ for almost 10 years now, and it's our way to bring the festival to our listeners. We have a radio station on the air at KEXP in Seattle, and we have a huge worldwide online audience at KEXP.org. And we come to these cities so that we can meet and become a part of the lives of our listeners, but also we want to bring the festival to people listening on the air and online. And it can feel kind of like they're here. So we're here for three days and we have bands every two hours over the course of eight hours. So it's a lot of great music to bring into the lives of our listeners. And CMJ is definitely a, a magnet festival and we felt like it was important for us to be here in New York. It was very surreal because it's very, it was early in the morning and I didn't know if anyone would be here. I thought everyone would be sleeping. Uh, but there were people here and they were fully dressed. They weren't in robes and uh, it seemed like they liked it. I like that CMJ allows a lot of different opportunities to present your music in non-traditional venues like this and, and there's just a lot of cool things going on and a lot of bands coming together and um, it just seems very exciting, all the hustle and bustle. I was invited by Sounds Australia. I've got an exhibition down in Thompson Street at Red Bull Space. I have a retrospect of my last 30 years work, uh, ranging from Iggy Pop, The Rolling Stones, Lucinda Williams, PJ Harvey, to Australian artists, Michael Hutchins, Nick Cave, and Kylie Minogue, and a few others. Uh, watching new bands is what music's all about. Um, uh, Cause I've obviously worked with a lot of you know, established and famous artists, people, make a really dreadful assumption that I don't want to work with new bands. New bands are always exciting, it's always great seeing new music, listening to new music and just discovering them. It's still a thrill. Um, that's why CMJ is really great. So much to see. Uh, if you can't find good music amongst it, <laughs> you're not only not listening, you're not into music. <laughs> 